continuing the blue bottle wave on our earth bag outdoor shower. First one going up. It is indeed. First one going up. This is the last like two or three bottles on this row too. I think, oh. yeah. Just this one, little, two, three, little yeah. section right here. Yeah. What's you up to, Mom? Well, Owen Creed had this idea to make a shelf and then set the frog on. So I thought what I could do is use this here. That sounds awesome. So we want to kind of put it out like. So the goal here is to just be a little shelf just coming out. Just, just a, little, a little, like bit. right here. That's all I'd go. Uh, should I go get some tape? Yeah, let's do it. That's okay. a good idea. We got a snazzy new fan. Well, I have to wire this puppy up safely, of course. Let's give her a test, huh? Oh, that's spinning. Is that still on? You could put your finger up in there. <laughs> yeah. <It's> your, tongue. <laughs> your tongue up in there? Yeah, you're right. I think we're moving the tree? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hope, right? That's right. But we could go another notch. I don't know, comment below if you think we're moving it. <laughs> <laughs> Does it look much different? I don't know, I'll have to compare it to the last videos, see if it looks much different. Bison, do we want to put any little nails in there? Yeah, we too? can do that. Should we do that for you? Yeah. All right, I'll go get a hammer and nails. Uh, no, we don't want to use a paint hammer. Here we go. That works. All right. Nails, hammer. That's a serious hammer. Right here, maybe? Just because, you know, we want more nails. The more nails, the better, right? I'll just help attach. I like that. I love how you didn't break a bottle. That's row two. We got two more on this side. So all this is done now up to this point. Um, yep. It's looking great, guys. It really oh is. God. It's going to be nice to be done with the blue bottle so we can move on to another step. I had just gotten through bragging about how Chip doesn't chew on any shoes. He just doesn't chew on any clothes. He chews on nothing. And then, you see this right here? That's from Chip. There was a bone that got trapped underneath my clothes. So he was trying to get to the bone. I was laughing. I was like, here I was. I just got through bragging about him and he chews through one of my shirts. <laughs> <laughs> but in the defense, there was a bone there underneath it. There was a it. bone underneath there. So. so he wasn't going after the shirt, but it was just, it was just funny. Can you hand this one to dad too? Oh, thank you. Nice. Shall we Ooh. test her out? But yeah. That looks good. That's a nice fan. Nice light in here. I'm gonna get started on putting up some of the shelving here. The last thing to do before we can start putting up curtains and moving furniture in. Very exciting. So I'm gonna get on this. We talked about doing kind of a cool like one shelf on the top with the clothes hanger on it. And then maybe two little shelves halfway down. Oh, it'll look really nice um, and symmetrical. Mama Bear? Oh. What are you got in here? Oh my goodness, look at him. Over here. Look at your little cuties. Oh, we gotta clean them up a little bit though, don't we? Aren't you a cute one? You got blue eyes. Yes, you do. <laughs> yeah. More vases going in? Yes. Yeah. Well, this looks evasive. Are you being evasive? <laughs> I really appreciate the evasive. Is it a vase or is it a vase? Ooh, oh, that's a good. Uh, it's a vasing. It's a vasing. <laughs> I love mom's death, but they're uh -oh. each huge. 
So this leaves me with a little <laughs> tiny crevice to build on. I don't I, mind the challenge, but it's I, a one layer deal. I'm not having any problems. No. I don't know what the deal is. <laughs> <laughs> this kept falling, so I fixed it. Oh, I like that. Smart. It's clever. Thank you very much. My solution to the current edge to problem. To I'm on the edge over here, Mom. Yeah, you, there's really not much room there, Brie. I still could. Yes. Well, why do those look the same color? Can I trade you? Yes. Three smaller ones for two bigger ones. Was that a fair deal? Hi, Brie. Uh, Don't think there should be a hole right there. There was suggestions on putting a jewel there, but I think I would feel most comfortable if it was completely stopped up. How about you, Brian? Yeah, I would agree. Yeah, silent in here. Kind of nice and kind of fun. Pick up the spirals coming around. Go this way. When you come out, you'll be able to walk this way in here. And you'll be in the, the shower area here. Don't you think it's pretty cool, Ma? Oh, yeah. I think it's really neat. I love it. Okay, you ready for this? Went ahead and got some like some nice blue ones that Ellie found. Yeah, they look good. Oh, that looks so good. Oh yeah, babe, these are perfect. We got everything done in the room that needs to be screwed into the walls. We're ready to start moving things in. We're ready to go. <laughs> Exciting, let's do it. Since we got our room all fixed up and nice, we really want to build a really cool headboard and nightstands for our bed. I was thinking of two different nightstands, but I found this really cool design where you put a headboard and you build the shelves into the headboard. And I'm gonna go ahead and give that a try with some pallet and hopefully it turns out really cool. Now this is gonna go underneath the window, so it's kind of gonna be a low profile headboard. But I really like this layout, so I think I'm gonna just get started standing all of these and I'll put these together and then work on the side shoots. Now that Ellie got all this stuff laid out, we're gonna screw it together. Fortunately, we have to flip it all over because this is the front. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna make right. that over there. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hi, dear boy. <laughs> Got any more? Right here, baby. Oh, look at that. This one's hungry, Mama. You guys trying to sneak some food? Huh? You guys trying to sneak some food? What's going on? Hey. Hey. Hi. the monster. Dun, dun. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> Look at that angle. Too, huh? It's like just leaning over the wall. I wonder if it's gonna handle the tamping okay. You know what we should have done? Ran pieces of wire around the neck. I still could. Why don't I do that? I could do that on that one. This, then we're just gonna... Yeah, you're just mortaring it in, aren't you? Yeah, and Bryson, you couldn't see it because I already it covered goes, it. It was it a goes, little loop to do. Yeah, it goes all the way back to there. You know? Put a couple more green bottles on this side, but I did not put them out. They're pretty much just... Flat. Yeah, they just left them flat. Yeah, now let's go see the other ones. That's solid. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh yeah, that's, that's a good one. That's solid on there. Wow, it's almost done. We're gonna build a frame for the back of this because we're gonna have some outlets that are gonna go into this. So we need a little bit of depth in the headboard. Cool, let's do it. I just can't forget where each one of these goes. Confidence in your memory. Do it once. Can fit there? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes, I guess. That's awesome. <laughs> no. Could run. Another row inside of this, you know? Whatever you think. We just gotta get all the seams connected. It doesn't really matter what we use, right? Yeah, I feel like we should build a framework. It would look nicest. Okay. Be good and solid. Yeah, let's do that. All right, we have a plan. Again, <laughs> we're gonna mark all this and then flip it on top of that table. So we gotta flip it back mm -hmm. over. I cannot believe this. Yep. Finishing all the whole thing together. Let's just do one board at a time. Should we do these? We may put some screws on some of the outside pieces to really hold it in, but we'll do those screws in a way that they look decorative. 
at least even. Yes. Oh, Oh, okay. one board, I, I got you carried too. <laughs> okay, so now let's just stack them all up. They should all sit on there, right? With the exception of maybe one. See if we line it up right. We did it perfectly. That's for your side. Put it there. Oh, thanks, darling. Karen got all the holes drilled perfectly six inches apart. Almost perfectly six inches apart. It came out really solid, actually. Yeah, it did. The screws definitely helped. These boards were super flimsy. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, I'm going to start working on the bed frame then. Now, what you start? Smelling. Oh, look at our shelf now. We get going on this section. Got to get bottles up here, don't you? For the yeah. top of this section. So what it looks like from over here is is it's done then. From this point of view, that's what it's gonna look like. It's gonna look like. Yeah, I think that's done there, huh? Yeah. Here. Looks like a hand grenade. It does. It does look like a little hand grenade. What do you think, right there? I don't know. You're the expert. I get it. I've just been watching everyone do this. Do you need to stick out? I don't think you do. I think you want to bing bing this thing down down. Oh, can you just rotate it? Yeah, yeah like that. Yeah, good good call, guy. That looks a bit high. It is high. You almost want to put it right here. Where? This come out. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> yep, there you go. Oh, that's yeah. it. That's it. Thanks, guy. It's going to go right in here, so whatever color is. Oh, maybe a light. Color. Light color. Mm -hmm. Got it. Kind of a fun bottle in there, huh? Nice. Say one more. That looks like the last of it, Bree. Is that the it last? It does indeed. I think it is. I was stepping back just to make sure, but I think that's all of it. Lots of fun little shapes. Now we can move on to rocks, I guess. Huh? Yep. Rocks next. So this is the bed frame that our bed has been sitting on. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these wheels off of it so strong it works good because then our headboard's low so it fits underneath the window and then i think we're going to do a skirt of pallet wood around the edge of the bed frame too kind of frame it in yeah, yeah. so i think i'm going to do something like this where i double stack uh, some of these thinner ones and then i cut some of these guys and i'm going to run one in the center to fix that gap and then a couple on the edges for decorative parts it also holds the two together like a skirt that goes around the edge just for looks there's no structure to it whatsoever so that should work pretty good i think this thing together huh that looks so cool Daddy. yeah it's pretty good dad's food all that work and then i accidentally just over send it it's okay that's what blankets are for right yeah put it together are you just gonna cut those off yeah i think i'll just zip those off with the angle grinder real fast two more babies yeah they look good and healthy too oh they're little fluff bunnies <laughs> Look at that little guy. Oh, Hi. That's, that's the dad, isn't it? Troublemaker. And that's the dad? Yeah. Oh. Very cool. Okay. Now we're gonna do this little rock area here. I got two different types of rocks. We have the jaggedy edge rocks and we have the river rock. Bryce and I decided we wanna use river rock in here. Somehow in here, and then that's what our turtle will set on. And the turtle's probably gonna be just metal art. We're gonna stick with Owen Creed's idea and then we're gonna go a little bit out with the rock so I'll have a place to set on that metal art on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. What is happening over here? <laughs> well, I kinda lost him, but. I think we're back in business. Traumatized over here from this one that fell. Okay, 
Okay, I got all this stuff to make the shelves. I'm gonna go ahead and assemble them right here. And then when we're ready, we'll mount them on the headboard when we can see exactly where we want them. I'm gonna go ahead and mount the outlet boxes to the headboard before we mount it to the frame because I think it's gonna be a lot easier to cut those holes and mount them in there when it's flat. Got some holes here for mounting the frame. I put some two by eights guys on the back here. That way when we mount this thing, we can really cinch it down and it'll be really solid. We're mounting this thing first before we put the shelves on. That way it's kind of easier to get the picture of what the shelves look like and make sure that they're in the right spot. That look better? Yes, not, yeah, that looks good. Other side. I think we're pretty much done with all the woodwork being of it. Now it's just electrical. We don't have quite enough room to put the light. Without it just being too low. And yeah, too close to this. So we got some galvanized plumbing. I think we're gonna cut it off and we're gonna mount it like this here. One on this side, one on this side. I just switch in the top. And then we have the outlets underneath the shelves and then everything will all be wired together for power and be plugged in in the outlet behind the bed. Yep. Let me get those lamp stands built and then I can start wiring everything. Stands, and at any point now, I think we can start putting the polyurethane on the wood because we should have no more wood cutting or screwing to do. I really like the just polyurethane pallet boards. It looks so cool. Yeah, I really like it too. Not to be nitpicky, but there's a, there's a drip that came out of that knot hole there. Oh my goodness. This is our buck. His name is Crash. We bought him dehorn, but you can see sometimes the dehorning doesn't do well because we won't talk about it. He's half Nigerian and half Nubian. So we thought it'd be fun to have kind of a smaller buck. This is Flower. She's the old lady, aren't you? We need to cut your beard. You're looking kind of manly. That's embarrassing. Isn't that nice? See how she just loves the beard being stroked. You love the beard being stroked? If I braided that, would you be okay with that? Oh, and here's Boots, who's too lazy to even stand up and eat. Actually, protects these goats. He does a good job at it, too, and he's in the weather. I'm pretty sure he sits there all day and eats that. <laughs> I'm, I'm really sure. Well, it's time, Bree. It is time. Time for some good old-fashioned soap dishes. <laughs> All right, let's get some mortar, which is right here, water, and the soap dishes. Now the soap dishes are just going to set in here, right? Yeah, thanks to all your ideas, I have some flat marbles that are blues and whites and greens that are gonna go in there. There was actually several that suggested it. What I'm excited about is that I was thinking around the triangle, it's gonna look really ugly with the mortar. So these little glass beads are gonna be absolutely perfect to add a little color and a little style mm -hmm. to them. <laughs> There's like a place where it naturally settles in that crock pot, isn't it? I have a slight bulging problem on the bottom. Nothing too big. Uh oh, we're losing it. Uh. I also have the this chair propping rock. method. Brie, <laughs> check that out. The chair is gonna work. Nice. Oh yeah, that's it's the it. old chair method, huh? <laughs> it seems to work every time, doesn't it? Let's keep that. All right, looks good. We'll come back and put the beads in. All right. And that sets. I got my two stands built for the light posts. Now they're gonna get a quick coat of black spray paint so that they, they blend in nicely. I'm gonna get started on the wiring here. Put two light switches. I think it's gonna be pretty straightforward. Just mount some boxes and put some wires together. We're getting the last couple things cut and that's gonna be these uh, switch covers here because I butted that up there. I need to create a little room in there. All right, let's see if we got it first try. Oh yeah. Now let's get this one. Man, we're two for two. It's pretty good. So should we put the light fixtures together? Yeah. Put the light bulbs in and uh, plug her in? Give it a test? Yeah. yeah. yeah let's do it. I think that's where we're at. Fancy little light bulbs. <laughs> I like the little purple. Plus, that orange in there matches the bronze. Yeah, although that's still a part. All right. 
Can so we grab the extension cord? You got it all, it all snazzy where you can just plug it in. That's so cool. Yeah. Hey! Hey! Those both work. <laughs> That's awesome, babe. Now we need to uh, check the outlets. Yeah. That works. <laughs> check the other one. That works too. All right, the headboard's, is the headboard done? Or the so. bed, the whole bed's done, isn't it? Should we go put it in our room? Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, this is awesome. And then here's one mama and her two little darlings. You got a little boy and a little girl. The spotted brown one is a little girl and the other one's a little boy. Now she's Flower's daughter. Yeah, she's a good goat. And then over here is where we're keeping the other mama and her two babies, three babies. Because they're Nigerian, they could have up to four babies. As Nubians are, if they're pure, the most they're gonna have are two babies. That's a little bit of the drawback. Her other two babies are on the other side of the fence. You should do a little loopy do to kind of clog the hole up. Build it up a little bit, like like slanted in the back. Oh, you know, be cute. Put a little bead in the hole. Yeah. <laughs> beat it. No one really wants to beat it. Are you saying beat it with putting beads on it? Yeah. If only those are hexagons. They fill in the space perfectly. Mix this up. I did like four blue ones in a row. Unbelievable. It's so cool, isn't it? We're just watching mom do all the work. <laughs> <laughs> We're the uh, cheerleaders for this project. Just cheer. Sorry, go, mom. Go, go, mom. Mom. Go, go mom. Go mom. Go mom. Go mom. Go mom. What are you doing, Mom? Mixing them. Because uh, I keep putting a whole bunch of the same colors together. Hexagon is the bestagon. If you have not seen that YouTube video, it is an amazing video. The hexagon is the bestagon. Link it in the description. We should. We Link should. It in the it's description. just, if you haven't seen it, it's solid. After you see it, it just, it becomes your life, doesn't it? The hexagon's everywhere. <laughs> well, you're looking through them. Dun, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Whoa. Wipe them off with a rag later, maybe? Yeah. Bolts are in there snug. It's a good thing. I think we need to take this headboard off now. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Could get the rest of it. Yeah, this is awesome. <laughs> that looks so cool. Yeah. We did it. We got the bed in. Yeah, it looks so good. It's nice. I, I love it. We got quite a bit more to do. We've made some idea changes, uh, like for instance, the closet here. We really like the idea of an open closet and actually the function of an open closet, but it just looks too bad for us. We just can't do it. We're going to build some sliding barn doors for the whole front of this thing. Can we have put some pictures of Azalea? <laughs> yeah, a lot more to come, but uh, we're really close. So. Yeah, coming along good. Seeing the wave come together has been the coolest thing. You know, when you first get started, you're like, how is this gonna work? You know, how's mm -hmm. it gonna look? Oh my gosh, to see the wave part of it, you know, where it goes up and down is so cool. I love all the colors those lines are. They don't look like bottles, they look like little round pieces of glass. But the river rock, oh my gosh, I love river rock, but I feel like it incorporating that into the design, I think it's just coming together really cool. Yeah, and those soap dishes, I think they're gonna work pretty good. This is gonna be a really stable places to put our soap. I think we're gonna be happy that we got a permanent place like that. Also, the crock pot came together really well too. You're putting it in there and you're like, I know this is gonna work, but then you have little moments of doubt. When you put it in that little soap caddy, it was just so cool and that really popped up loose as well. And then all the little beads in there. It's the coolest look. I'm really happy with it. We'll be bagging next. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got so. now more bags that's gonna go on top of the wave. Big belly. 
up this week. We thought the perfect design this week is our mama and baby goat design that we have here. If you'd like to get this on a t-shirt, sweatshirt, handbag, apron, or many of our other products that we offer in store, along with all the designs that we have over there, the link will be down in the description. If you've never tuned into a podcast before, we answer questions and comments, usually from the most recent weekly peak. So who knows, your question or comment might have made it into previous ones if you've not tuned into one before, or it could next week, who knows. We really love being able to respond to you share your ideas and tell you thank you if we incorporated one of your ideas. We really appreciate you being a part of our family. We hope you join us for this Monday's podcast. Bye. Thank you. So what happens behind the scene? We have to figure out where cameras are going so that we can uh, properly film this. What's that? Shower head. <laughs> An up facing shower head. Yeah. Can you imagine going to the shower and it, and it shoots up? Close your Spray eyes. Tight. Clean. <laughs> it never cleans this part of your face, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I worked so hard to clean this. Oh. Right, Unbelievable. Bye. 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 <laughs> and then usually when she learns something. What is it that you want? What is it? Ah. <laughs> yes. Our family moved from the city to the country. Thanks for taking part in our adventure. We have new videos every Friday evening. If you would like to help us out, you can like this video, share it, subscribe, or support us on Patreon. See the links in the description. And Flower lost half her horn. We don't know where. Yeah, Maria really lost that. that. She loves attention. If he stood up, he'd tower over me. Wouldn't you? She's good. He doesn't. You don't like Bryson? No, he doesn't. Well, that's not usual. Everybody likes Bryson. Okay, he said, he said you're okay. okay this is... <gasps> Goldfish! Yes, uh -oh. they get everywhere.